Okay, hello. Uh, this is something really different to what I usually do. Usually I'm making videos on sci-fi shooter games, um, or just indie games and just gaming in general. Um, today, I'm showing you my Pokemon card collection. There is no gameplay here, it's just my webcam, and I'll be showing you several cards that I have. Um, I just counted and I have around 150 graded Pokemon cards, which I didn't realize I had. <laughs> I've just been stockpiling them over the past like three or four years, and um, I didn't realize I accumulated so many. So I thought, never done this before, let's make a video showing you them all. Um, I'm not gonna hesitate, let's just jump in. We'll start off with some low grades and work our way up. So. First thing we've got is we actually have uh, two of these, I think. I've got another one in here somewhere. A graded 7 near mint Charmander from uh, 2000, is it? Yeah, Team Rocket Charmander from 2000. Uh, I'm going to speed through because there's a lot. So Here we've got another 7. It's a Gardevoir EX. We've got another 7. I think there's a few 7s in this pile. Uh, Mewtwo GX from um, Legends. Is it Shining Legends? Yes. There we go. All these are graded by different companies too. I think the majority are ace grading because they're just the fastest turnaround UK service. Um, we've got a, an Evolutions Charizard Grade 7. Um, now, yes, it's a graded 7, but I believe this is still worth like 200 to 250 for a 7 of this. That's pretty uh, pretty geared. And then we've got that same card on a 6, so we'll just dash over that very quickly. Uh, we've got this, which got a 6, which at the time I was really annoyed about. Um, I don't really care too much anymore, but um, it was pack fresh. Well, that's that one, I was a bit iffy on Ace with this one. I almost contacted them. Um, literally, pack fresh, sealed immediately. So I don't understand how it's a 6. Um, the centering isn't the best, but that alone should not warrant such a low grade. Um, so yeah, I'm very tempted to crush this one and uh, send it to a different grading company and see if it comes back with the same grade. Um, then we've got a Hisuian Samurott 8, nothing special there. Uh, we've got a 2000 uh, Team Rockets Dark Charizard, um, so that's cool. Uh, but I only got a 5. I was hoping for more. Uh, oh, some higher grades in here. There's a 9 for a Hisuian Zoroak. And another 9 for a Zisu or Zaisu, however you say it. I'm not sure. I'm not up to date on the latest games. Um, I think the, the last one I played was Black and White. So, uh, a Zacian V and a, an Entei V as well. There we go. So that's the first stack of cards and I have 10 stacks altogether. All right. Next we have an Adaman V7. Don't worry, there's a lot of 10s when we get into it. Uh a Blissey V8. Zekrom got a 6. An 8 with a dark eye. Snorlax 8. No, we we know Snorlax eats. I mean, he got he got I got an eight like he, he, an eight. <laughs> uh, Opal. I don't know who this character is. <clears throat> um, Hoot Hoot, Morpeko, and an Origin Form Palkia all have an eight as well. Excuse the coughing. I'm recovering from uh, a viral infection, which is great. So. Uh, <clears throat> there we go. <laughs> All right, some higher grades. Uh, what are we looking for here? So there's another pile. Giratina V8, uh, Weavile 8, and here we go. Now we're into some higher numbers. Uh, so a V Star Giratina got a 9. Boom. Sorry about the reflection on these. Um, it's hard to see them sometimes because my. My monitor's reflecting. Uh, there you go, Tyranitar V9. Uh, an 8 on this. I don't know what that is, to be honest. A Charizard with a 9, which is pretty cool, from Pokemon Go. It's not a, a major card, just if you get any Charizard and it grains a 9 or above, you just you keep it. Um, Zacian, 9. 
Another Tyranitar. It's got an 8. I don't know why I graded that one, actually. Uh, this is cool. And uh, an Arceus V9. Uh, that's a promo card, I think. Right? Yeah, promo card. It's from, um, it's from this, actually. How convenient. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> there you go. That's what it's from. Um, not the USB cable. I seem to have dragged along with it. Boom. Might do another video on my uh, sealed products collection because I also have a ton of sealed Pokemon products too. Um, that's actually worth more than my graded cards. So uh, then we've got Rapid Strike, that thing, <laughs> and uh, this is really cool. I wish it was a ten though. Uh, the price jump is insane. This is an Umbreon V Max from uh, V Max Climax. Uh, which is really cool. It's a Japanese set. So, yeah, the artwork's so cool how the red around it just, like, glows. So that's uh, awesome. Right. <clears throat> We're six minutes in. I think I've done pretty well to go through all that in six minutes. On to the next. Another stack of cards here. We have uh, Suiyin Zoroark V-Star, which I showed before, but this is, uh, like, a... a graded one. Um, I need to make a new stack here. There we go. A graded nine Pikachu. Uh, Mimikyu nine. This is a Blastoise, which I thought was pretty cool. Again, nothing like special, but just when it's a starter Pokemon like that, I just feel like you got to grade it. Uh, this is cool. I think I have a 10 of this as well somewhere. Um, so we've got a Charizard character card. Uh, some more nines in here, yep. Here we go. We've got a Jirachi and an Abomasnow. They're both nines from Ace Grading. Another Arceus card again. A nine on that one. I think we've already shown this too at one point. Might have some duplicates. A, a nine Weavile. Another Origin Form Palkia. And uh, I got a Piplup, which uh, I bought this one because I just like Piplup so much. He, he was my starter in Diamond and Pearl every time I played. So uh, I got a Piplup, uh, but it only got an 8, which is unfortunate. Uh, I might get that card again and see if I can get a 10. So there we go. All right. Uh, let's move on. I need to grab this the stack without making too much noise. Um, here we go. Another stack. So we've got a Charizard. These, these are like, we're getting into the cooler cards now. There's a Charizard here. There you go, Charizard V-Star 9. Uh, we've got a Lugia, which got an 8. Is that Celebrations? Yes. Uh, I've got two of these. Is the other one in here as well? No. Okay, well, I do have two of these. Um, Origin Form uh, Dialga, which got a nine. There's another one somewhere around here. Um, Piers, that got a nine. Boom. Here's another one of the um, Hisuian Zoroark V-Stars. That has a nine. Uh, I love this artwork. Gengar, this has a ten. There we go. And here's another horror, um, yeah, uh, wait, horror, horror, <laughs> Hisuian, Zoroark, V-Star, the gold card version, uh, that got a 10, so that's nice to get. Another Charizard that got a 10, boom. And then, uh, Giratina, V-Stars, both the regular and rainbow, both getting 10s. And uh, last but not least, a 10 Kingdra in there as well. Boom. I'd say we're approaching halfway. Speeding through them. I'm trying not to knock over this giant tower that I've built in the process. Which I think you can actually see. <laughs> you can see here in the corner. Right. Uh, we've got another Giratina, actually. Uh, 10 for that. We've got an Adamant 10 Rainbow. Uh, an Aerodactyl 10. Uh, this is cool. The the um, <laughs> the label barely fits on this one. Uh, that's the tag team card 
uh, for Reshiram Charizard. Um, oh no, just Reshiram and Charizard. Yeah, yeah. I thought there was someone else in there. Yeah. There we go. Reshiram and Charizard. Uh, we've got a Zapdos. Ten. Boom, boom. Uh, Charon's Care, 10. And there's the other, there we go. The Charizard um, character card, they've got a 10. And the cool Ace label. This, I love this card as well, one of my favourites. Um, an Umbreon V. Umbreon's one of my favourite Pokemon. Uh, that got a 10, so that's nice. Ooh. Then we've got a Rockruff, 10. And some Mortens here. Uh, there's a Blastoise. Now, don't you know? Don't scream and shout. It's not the the original Blastoise. It might look like it. Uh, it's from Celebrations, so it's like a remake. Um, so yeah. And then there's actually a six in here. This must be in the wrong pile. But there's a Dialga EX from uh, 2013. That's an old one. There we go. Boom. Okay. Moving on. Now, at this point, I'm going to tell you there is one stack of cards, which is the same card over and over again. <laughs> I bought several of the same card, uh, but it's not this stack. So, starting off with another cool one, we've got a 2017 Sun and Moon Umbreon GX. I got a 9. Here's the other origin form. Uh, there we go. Uh, a couple nines in here, which I seem to have missed out. So, Dusk Noir, uh, Hisuian Arcanine. Some, oh, I missed this pile completely. There's some eights in here as well. We've got um, Hisuian Samurott and a, what's that? Cleavor. Let's just speed through these ones quick, quick, quick. Uh, Mightyena and Kingdra, eight and nine. Uh, Beedrill, another Zisu, and Phalanx. We all have nines. There you go. Right, back to the tens. So, we have a 2019 um, Sun and Moon uh, Pikachu with Ash. It's pretty cool. I got a nine again. I would have loved a ten for that card. Uh, we have uh, another 2019 card. This is Mewtwo and Mew GX. Uh, a 2022. Again, um, Mew. Mewtwo, I mean. There you go. Is it Mewtwo and Mew or? Uh, just Mewtwo. Oh, wait, Mewtwo. There's a, Char there's a Charizard in the background, but it's a Mewtwo card. Yeah, I got a 10. That's nice. Um, what else do we have in here? Some more 10s. A Rainbow Zissou and a 10. We've got an Umbreon VMAX in a 10. Another Umbreon in a 10. <laughs> uh, Barry in a 10, who's from Diamond and Pearl. We've got two of these Arceus V cards, both in tens. And then Samazenta V and Jolton V. Boom. All right. Moving on. Um, some more Muse and stuff here, which is pretty cool. Um, Let's show these. I've got two um, graded seven uh, Charizard base set cards from from base set two. So these are from 2000. So these are worth a, a little bit, but nothing huge. Um, but these are, hello. Uh, yeah, Charizards, <laughs> one from PSA, one from Brekkit, uh, both graded seven from 2000. There we go. Thumbnail, maybe? Charizards. <gasps> um, 
So yeah. Then we've got some Charmanders from the same year. These got eights. Uh, and then some more Charizards, which got uh, sixes, unfortunately. Again, pack fresh. Ace grading, what's going on? Someone in our team is uh, dirtying my cards or something. There we go. <laughs> then there's a, a Mewtwo EX 9.5 by Beckett. And a graded 10. Uh, Mew and Mewtwo EX. Again, I feel like I already showed that off at some point. Um, might have two of those. <clears throat> so, that's all my cards besides this stack, which are all the same. <laughs> and it is just an absolute ton of the new uh, Pikachu from um, Crown Zenith. Um, so, here is one of them. This is a 10 from PSA. We have another 10 from PSA. We've got a 9 from PSA. And another 9 from PSA. And then we've got a 10 from Ace Grading. Another 10 from Ace Grading. A 9 from Ace Grading. And then we've got a 10 from uh, Pokegrade. And a 9 from Pokegrade. And there you go. That, as far as I'm aware, is all my graded Pokemon cards. Um, around 150 cards. Um, if not, I've done the math wrong, and there will be 150 and higher when I get my next return. I have some cards that are currently being graded. They're in the stage of getting graded by Ace, um, and they should be returning hopefully in the next like five or six days. Um, so realistically, I should, probably should have left this video until they came back um but maybe this will kickstart some some pokemon content on my channel um and i can just keep on doing uh graded card send-offs and returns so i'll show you the cards i'm sending and then another one when they come back um yeah that'd be cool uh so you'd get some pokemon content from me every month or so um yeah Again, as I said, not something I'd usually do, and there probably isn't going to be too much interest in this one <clears throat> from my regular um, audience. This video probably will flop, but it's only 20 minutes of my time, and uh, Pokemon is something that I enjoy. I enjoy collecting the cards, um, so I thought I'd make it, because, uh, you know, I don't mind doing this kind of video, because I like Pokemon. <laughs> so yeah, I might do another one, as I said, on my sealed Pokemon card collection, no, not card, uh, well, Pokemon product collection. I've got tons of Elite Trainer boxes that are sealed, um, a couple of tins, uh, what else have I got? Let me just have a look around here. I've got some new 151 set stuff, like the Zapdos collection. Um, I've got some booster um, packs and, and booster boxes, with, like, I have like six boosters in them. Um, I've got, um, like the full booster boxes, gonna be 36 cards, um, so yeah, there's, there's quite a lot of stuff <clears throat> that I've collected over the past three or four years, um, and it'd be cool to show all that stuff off as well. So yeah, thanks for watching this video, um, and, um, let me know what you think of my collection, <laughs> and I'll see you in the next one, goodbye.